guys, today we talk about the Altitude 13s that came in a few months ago. Tune in. Hey guys, welcome to Cost Station where we talk sneakers. My name is Zoe. And if you're here for the first time, make sure you hit that subscribe button and even that notification bell so you don't miss any dope sneaker content. The sneaker you've all been waiting for, the Altitude 13. Man, oh man, these sneakers right here are dope sauce. A lot of people, in my opinion, slept on these sneakers right here, and I personally think they're dope. This is, I think, the third time they've released, and in addition to that, the main reason why I wanted to get these sneakers, I'm Nigerian, and I'm like a soccer fiend, especially when it comes to the World Cup. So I know a lot of you guys are probably about, man, I'm all about MJ and basketball. Dude, I'm about soccer. Like, I, like in terms of soccer, that's like the most popular sport in the world. These are dope sneakers, and they're gonna match perfectly with my Nigerian jersey when I support them come World Cup time. Anyways, getting into this sneaker right here, you can notice that around it, it's covered all in black, obviously. And then at the bottom right here, you have that altitude green color, hence why they call it altitude. 13s and also you have a little hit with the Jumpman logo right here of that altitude green as well in addition to the Jordan logo right here at the bottom of the sneaker toe box. You can see that on the side, whoa, that almost fumbled. Notice that on the side of the sneaker, you'll see a little bit of what they call Stingray, but I'm pretty sure, you know, when I go to the aquarium and feel those Stingrays or whatnot, the Stingrays don't feel like this, so I don't really know if this is real Stingray, but overall, to me, it's a good look. You also notice that on the medial side of the sneaker as well, and overall, I think the leather is really good on this sneaker, but again, who knows what real leather is? Like, I'm no leather professional, but to me, this feels really plush. In addition to that, it feels really soft, so I think it's good quality leather overall. Also, you get that patented Air Jordan Jumpman logo in there as well as the 23. To me, when it comes to Air Jordan 13s, they definitely fit me um, a half size down, but that's just me though. They fit me analogous to my Air Jordan 1s, but for you guys, I would suggest going true to size or trying the sneaker on. Another good thing about this sneaker is I got it for a discount off of Nike.com for about 140 bucks or so. I waited because I know I knew these guys were gonna go on sale and I wanted them from the beginning. But I was just waiting for that sale. So you know, think smart sometimes when it comes to buying sneakers. So my quick conversation about these sneakers is up for today, guys. I appreciate all of you guys, the old and the new subscribers. Please continue to watch my video, and I'll see you guys all on the next episode of Casa Station. Deuces.